My name is Vani Singh and I've been in the kitchen for as long as I can remember. Nowadays, it's tough to prepare a home-cooked meal after a long day, but I'm going to share some great tips and tricks with you so you can make a healthy dinner in a snap. Tonight, we'll be preparing something extra special. I'm cooking fish on papillote. Don't let the name intimidate you though, because all it means is that I'm steaming fish in a packet. I'll be serving that with a side of oven-fried sweet potatoes. Again, it's a meal that's very simple to make and very, very healthy. I have all of my ingredients here, so let's get the show on the road. Peel one onion. Cut into rings. Crush two small pieces of ginger. Cut into chunks. Chop two pimentos. Squeeze the juice of two medium limes into a bowl. Add a quarter cup of low sodium soy sauce. Add the ginger. Add the pimentos. Whisk together and set aside. Cut two medium sweet potatoes into cubes. So now that I've gotten my sweet potatoes all chunked up, all I have to do now is to put them into a baking dish. And to that, you want to drizzle a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of coarse salt, and some fresh ground black pepper. Give that a quick toss. You can use a spoon, you can use your hands. I personally like to get my hands in there. And once you've done that, I'm going to put that into an oven that's about 425 degrees Fahrenheit and let that bake up for about 20 minutes or until it's nice and crispy and golden. And because it takes just a little bit longer to cook, I'm going to pop that into the oven right before I put my fish in. So my sweet potatoes are in the oven and it's now time to make our fish packets. I have here my marinade which is soy sauce, lime juice, pimento and ginger. And on top of that I'm going to be putting sprigs of thyme and fresh onion rings. I'm going to start with large pieces of foil. Now our papillote is usually with parchment paper but uh, foil packets work just as well. So let me show you how you start. You fold it in half, you are trying to achieve a crease and then you open it. To that is where you're going to add your fish fillet. And on top of that, go ahead and spoon some of the ginger and pimento, soy sauce and lime. And you're creating a pocket to seal in all of the steam and everything is going to cook in that steam. So once that happens, you're going to get all of the flavor of the fine thyme, you're going to get all of the flavor of the onions and even the chunks of ginger. So here's how you're going to begin making your packet. You're going to create a right angle where the fish begins. Keep rolling that, sealing it off until it's shaped like that. I'll just repeat the others and we put it in the oven. So now my fish en papillote is ready. It's time to place it in the oven. It's going to be joining the sweet potato that's already in progress. So there you have it, it's all finished. And that was so simple, it took just about 20 minutes. And what we want to do now is to get one of these packets and I like to serve it up in the packet itself. You want to get a pair of scissors and you want to cut along the top. Be careful of the steam. It's so moist. I can't wait to get into it. Every time I do fish on papier, I surprise myself because it's amazing just how much flavor you can actually get out of the simplest ingredients. And how about our sweet potatoes? Crunchy on the outside, sweet and soft on the inside, and that olive oil just does magic. And of course I have a side salad that I'm having with the meal. This is certainly a recipe that you can do in a snap at home. Dinner in a Snap is brought to you by the Ministry of Health. 